Hello everyone and welcome to Streaming Tech Now. I hope everyone's doing well. Have you ever wanted to add your favorite website to your Fire Stick but you just weren't quite sure how to do it? There's actually two fast and easy ways and in this video I'm going to show you how to do that. But if you have a Fire Stick, as you all know, there's just a limited amount of storage so you can only install so many apps. So being able to add a website and then bookmarking it just opens up the possibilities. I'm going to show you how to do that fast and easy coming right up. Okay, so I'm going to show you the first way, which is directly through the browser. Now, I'm going to show you how to bookmark your favorite website using the three most popular websites. The first one is the Amazon Silk browser then it's going to be Firefox and then Puffin TV. Now, I'm not going to show you on this video how to actually get Puffin browser, but I will show you how to get the Amazon Silk browser as well as Firefox. And if you don't have it on your device already, it's very easy. Just simply go right to the top to this magnifying glass, scroll down and then start typing Silk, S I L K. And as soon as you type in SI, it will automatically populate right there. Right there it says Silk Browser. Just click the enter button on your remote. It's going to pull up the Silk Browser right there. And then right next to it is Firefox. So all you need to do is just simply click the enter button twice. It will download it. Then come and do the same thing for Firefox. I recommend getting both of them. They're both excellent. So I'm going to show you through Silk, and then I will show you the other two. So what we're going to do is open it up. Just click the Enter button. And what's going to happen is it's going to automatically default to the very last website that you are on. So in order to get to the main search page, simply click the three horizontal lines, which is called your menu icon on your remote. This button right here. Click that, that's gonna bring you to this page. And what you wanna do is that orange search bar, just click the enter button, it's gonna pull up the keypad right here. And what you wanna do is, this is where you're gonna type in whatever website you want. So for the purpose of the video, I'm just gonna do um, amazon.com, and then I will click go, and then just give it a second, and it's gonna bring you right to the website of your choosing. So once you go to the website of your choosing, then simply click the menu icon again. It's going to bring you right back here. It's going to bring you here. And what you want to do is to scroll to the very right, click the right directional, and it says add bookmark. So click the enter button again, and boom, right there. It will click it, it will save it as a bookmark right there. So the next time you come in here, all you have to do is just click this and it will bring you right to that particular website. Now let's say you want to get rid of this. You don't want this one anymore. It's really easy to get rid of. Just simply click that menu icon and then it brings up the option to delete it and you can just simply click the enter button and it will delete it. That's it. That's how easy it is to do it on Silk. Now let me go back to the home screen. I'm going to show you how to do it on Firefox. Now Firefox is just a little bit different. They call it, uh, instead of calling it bookmarks or favorites, they actually call it pin tiles. So scrolling down right here, these are favorites and now they come standard on Firefox. Of course you can delete these, you can change them um, if you want to, but let me show you how to get a website on Firefox. So all you do is to go up to this blue box right here, you're gonna click the enter button, it's gonna pull up the keypad and you're gonna type in whatever website you want. So I'm gonna just leave this website. This is the uh, parent company for Google. It's a safe website, so I'm gonna just go ahead and leave that. I'm gonna click Next. So it's gonna take you right to that website. So this should be the website that you just typed in. And once you have that, then what you wanna do is click that menu icon on your remote control. It's gonna bring you back to this home page right here and just scroll right up to the very top and as you can see, this icon right here, it says pin to home screen and that's what you want. So click that enter button on your remote and it will pin it. It says pin to the home screen. So if you click the menu icon and you scroll down, you'll notice right there, there it is. So that is the website that we just pinned. Now let's say that you no longer want that and you wanna delete that. All you do is click the enter button and hold it. And then you get this option to remove. So you would just click the enter button and boom, it removes it. That's how easy it is to do on Firefox. 
Let me go back to the home screen and I'll quickly show you how to do it using Puffin Browser. Puffin Browser is a very popular browser for Fire Stick. So go ahead and click the enter button to open it up. And what we want to do is we want to click the menu icon. That will bring you to the main page, which is called the start page. So scroll to the right and click the enter button right on the search bar and it's going to bring up the keypad. So right here is where you're going to type in whatever website you want. I'm going to just type in this safe website for purposes of the video. And then click next. Now it's going to bring you to this page right here and it just wants you to confirm that is in fact the website you want. Yes it is. So all you do is click the enter button on your remote it will bring you right to that website. Now, on Puffin Browser, to add it as a favorite or save it as a bookmark, it's very easy, it's just a little bit different. All you do is, right here, all you do is click the menu icon, and then as you can see, just click down, and it says add to bookmark. Just click the enter button, and it says add it to bookmarks successfully. Now, let's go back to the start page. So click the menu icon, and then just click the back button right there and it will bring you right back and as you can see it says my bookmarks go to the right and there it is right there there is the website that we just added as a bookmark now if we don't want that one anymore and we want to get rid of that all you do is you just have to actually go into it so click the enter button you're gonna go right back onto it click that menu icon and now it's gonna give you the option to remove it so you would just click the enter button on remove and it says successfully removed from bookmarks so if you go back to the start page click the back button and you'll notice under bookmarks there's nothing now it's still there for recently viewed but that's because it's recently viewed now you can clear your browsing history and it's no longer there but as you can see we successfully removed it under bookmarks so that's how easy it is to do it on the browser directly now let me show you an alternative way to save your favorite website okay so the second and final way is a really unique way that Amazon actually gives you called the bookmarker applications now they have like nine of them they also have a Roku one simply devoted to the Roku channel now this is what it looks like I'm gonna show you how to do one and basically it's just like this tile it's like an app so you can actually program whatever website you want right inside of that bookmarker number one so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and bookmark that Google website right in there and I'm gonna show you how easy it is so all you do is you got to go to the um, magnifying glass and then go down and just type in bookmarker right there as soon as you type in book you'll notice that it has right here bookmarker number one and then when you pull that up as you can see you have a number of different options so if you have several different websites you can bookmark several so I'm just gonna show you how to do it real real fast and easy so all you do is just go ahead and click the enter button and we're gonna wanna go ahead and click the enter button again to download it and it just takes a second so go ahead let's just let it download real quick it's gonna install and as soon as it's done there it is it says open we're gonna open it up and then right here this is where we need to just simply enter the website so I'm gonna go ahead and enter a b c dot x y z now of course you're gonna enter whatever website you want click next and then it says always open with Amazon silk browser or you can always open with Firefox. So those are your two options. So before you do this option, obviously you're gonna have to first download the Silk browser and the Firefox browser, okay? So make sure you do that first. So then once you do that, then just choose the one that you want. I'm gonna just leave it on Silk browser and then click the enter button on save settings. And then it's gonna bring you to this page. Just simply click the enter button again and that's it guys that's how easy it is so if I go to the home screen there it is right here now when I click it watch what happens 
it's going to open up. Now remember, Silk automatically defaults to whatever website you were previously on. So it might go to a website and you're probably saying to yourself, well, that's not the website I program. Just give it like two or three seconds and then it will automatically default to whatever website you programmed it to. Okay, so as you can see, this is the one that we programmed it to. It opened right up. So that is a second way where you can bookmark your favorite website. I hope you guys thought this information was helpful. Hit that thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Thank you so much for joining me today, and I will see you next time on Streaming Tech Now.